हाय हाँ नमस्कार इट्स माय फर्स्ट टाइम इन अहमदाबाद तो यू नो अ लॉट ऑफ द कल्चर एंड एवरीथिंग ऑफ कोर्स यू नो इट बिकॉज़ ऑफ द टेक्सटाइल एंड द लिटरेचर यू गाइस हैव एंड इट्स सच एन अमेजिंग thanks for inviting me and uh, really people who have seen my work not seen my work it truly doesn't matter but what matters is that we keep it interactive and uh, like i was telling someone that it's amazing to know um, how the world is evolving through your minds and your perspective because uh, actors live in our own orbits because of the nature of our work sometimes and sometimes the process um so uh, please uh, fire up any any conversation that can help me really think about life differently i suppose so i think um, what we can do is probably talk about um, what are the current projects that you're working on and then probably we can move on so i don't know like my journey actually started from theater i did a lot of uh, street plays in um, in in delhi um i somebody was asking me aapka aapka college ka uh, you know atmosphere kaisa tha aisa mujhe pata hi nahi kyunki after school i wanted to act so much that i did everything uh, to make sure that i was acting or i was performing or i was doing backstage and just helping the process because that's all i wanted to do and this college took me um um in sociology honors only because my street play uh, was really good i had good concepts and everything so yeah so because of that and i rarely spent any time in college actually i spent more time outside of it uh, trying to you know do other things to actually make sure that i went to nsd but nsd never took me because i did such amateur theater at that time and i didn't have any access and i came to bombay uh, knowing very well that uh, already there's such a benchmark for women that uh, you know uh, the entire construct is shoving you off the rack if you're 24 and i um, you know took that challenge saying that i need a new adventure in my life and delhi was that when you um, you, you know you can't romanticize as an artist a place that gives you something that it used to and i'm like okay what new story can i tell so bombay was one of that and uh, the time i came there was only say a balaji uh, you know or there was a lot of cinema the cinema i grew up with was a very far fetch dream you know it was just very far away because uh, my parents or where we come from are educators you know my father wanted me to be an engineer do mb uh, um, mba or be an ias officer and you know have credibility like that they just didn't understand how to support an artist and uh, and they didn't think being an actor was an art it was like ha abhi hobby hai abhi chala bhi jayega <laughs> so it was uh, one of those things and uh, when i came to bombay without any access and everything you just uh, learn the ropes by being i mean again you have no opportunity to romanticize because this becomes like you're just only only aspiring to be an actress how it's happening you don't know you have resentment it's a human process you have bitterness you go through stagnancy you go through that process of ya nahi ho raha then you get delusional then your bubble bursts and you get one thing after another thing and after another thing then it becomes a trajectory so my trajectory started from there it's just an asp- aspiration it's a dream it's like you know class mein kuch samjhate the main bahar dekhti thi so it it was almost like that it's like the depth i only understood by lucidity of like a dream and uh, of course the inspirations were smita patel and sri devi yeah. i always maintain that uh, you know and i'm just like if they could there is a possibility we all can yeah. and uh, they made it possible for someone like me who is a nobody actually uh, to have this uh, kind of uh, dream and then from there i feel like lion when i did this film called lion by garth davis with dev patel and nicole kidman that's when the world changed for me when i say it's a transformational process for someone like me is when 
इट्स लाइक अगेन दैट वर्ल्ड इज बिकमिंग स्टैगनेंट सिंग दैट ओके अभी तो ओ भी नहीं हो रहा है तो हिंदी सिनेमा भी नहीं हो रहा है बिकॉज यू आर नॉट द टाइप ए यू नो पर्सन आर्टिस्ट यू नो यू 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 आर समथिंग बट यू आर नॉट दैट and uh, the, the the entire construct again will tell you that you are separate from us you know yeah. 100% it will happen it is it is what it is and there's no other uh, discussion about it we can't intellectualize it um and then suddenly when lion happens and the world opens and then you see there is diversity and suddenly this diversity is given so much spotlight because i feel in india we are the most diverse where i feel we are so different from each other where it comes from a conditioning or sect in even 4 hours drive will change the dialect of your language there is nothing more diverse than that and i'm just like oh this is interesting spotlight on that and i'm like oh now i see myself amongst all of these people one is an aboriginal one is uh, an actress from new zealand there is a place for all of us that's where i am and right now there's this uh, <coughs> there's this tv show up i'm doing called the wheel of time um which is led by rosamund pike and uh, it's on prime amazon it's an international uh, project um it's my in, uh, introduction to the ott and the ott in in india uh is very separate uh, from this this is the milieu i know so i don't want to let go because i'm also very selfish and greedy <laughs> as an actress so mm. as you must be you know you want all the good things for yourself yeah. and uh, so yeah so i'm 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 in the process of balancing both work there and here because i've worked hard here also okay so uh when you started talking you said that most of the times you were not in a classroom and uh, you so i don't think that's a very inspirational statement to say in front of students sorry <laughs> but it's true <laughs> but jokes apart um see bahut sare artists hote hain you know lot of us um, i grew up aspiring to be a full time musician mm. to create music to perform par creativity se pet nahi bharta the truth of life is ke hum kitne bhi creativity apne andar you know jagar kar le Uh, even if you go and perform, at the end of the day, we have to pay bills. EMIs come. Mm -hmm. How do you strike that? How does one strike that balance of passion and professionalism? That's such a good question because mm -hmm. it's something I am also in the process of, uh, you know, learning myself. Where because I, I again, I had a small dream of being an actress. I didn't know how it was. Yeah. So I did everything because there was no acting classes in our college. i specialized in uh, sociology of course my humanitarian work will uh, you know support that but um, i only wanted to make my parents proud and prove it to them that i can make my ends meet without asking for support um so that was my only little goal and it happened from very simple things saying that apna rent aa jaye bas from there to now i'm able to pay emi of my first uh, home that i have bought in the city so it takes a long journey to understand and really um not uh, you know creativity is not uh, separate from uh, uh, realistic um, need for support uh of being able to support yourself as a woman and uh, or as a man but more so women because you know i feel like uh, uh, a lot of the construct we have to actually learn how to invest in ourselves that we don't know yet our colleges and the schools don't teach us how to invest money like that's something we have to empower ourselves with so i'm educating myself still where i have come a long way from someone who just only needed that much money to pay my paying guests yeah. to to come to terms with the fact that you know what I still have that fear ki kahan se aayega but I'm just like listen I need everything was a challenge right I challenge myself chalo bombay chal jayenge kuch nahi hai I challenge myself as chalo it's a uh, you know uh, as a uh, again challenge was I had a child um where all my peers were only concentrating on their careers so to be called brave you know that narrative is so shoddy for me why be called brave when this is the way i want to lead my life 
where yeah. you know why why bravery for what i don't yeah. want that bravery award yeah. i just want to make my life just respectable and i want to go back home and tell my parents oh see now you're proud of me <laughs> you know things yeah. like that it's really that simple it i mean we don't need bravery awards for that yeah but so um kudos to that but uh, so now we're in 2023 and uh, i'm sure yahan jitne baithe hain unme se bhi there must be a lot of people who are influencers or who have a sizable number of followers yeah. and that's what it has come to yeah. so now creativity is getting measured uh, not that earlier it wasn't but now it has become more apparent that um, x million views means probably this guy is very creative yeah. um, uh, x lakh uh, followers means this guy is a good singer does that affect how you work see it affects not the way you work or your ethics but if it affects you're a human being to be constantly compared to your numbers that your instagram following or a certain thing and not your voice or whatever or, or your talent yeah. or what you stand up for will be used as a term called incompetent by other influencers who want to be actors it it's not hurtful but i'm just like it's questionable and i think i have come off experience right now to question it and it is what it is yes but i don't want to keep it there i want to go a little uh, you know layered where i just want to ask is it what are we influencing if we are not influencing a thought process am i only um as an actor that's the only thing you can do right uh, ki mujhe ye script mile main pehle apne aap se puchu main kyun kar rahi hu why am i doing it you've come obviously it's the same thing it's like all of you guys you're studying whatever you're studying you're specializing you've asked yourself this question why am i doing it and you can always change that process like you know thing later on but you have to ask that question so that whole influencing culture i don't look down upon there are no biases uh, i laugh at it a little bit when they tell me that uh, you know iske to million followers hain wo na i'm like you know what a rejection to isme bhi hai usme bhi hai imagine a actor going inside an audition or meeting saying that pehle hi ki tum ye maan lo ki reject hone wale ho right <laughs> you know us usko leke hum aage jate hain then i'm just like listen this this affects me but at the same time i'm just like uh, will there be no takers for me i don't think so i, I don't think i'm unwritable you know itna to conviction hai सो so, uh, मैं एक पहले जो सवाल पूछा था उस पर मैं वापस आता हूँ सो so, ये कन्विक्शन क्रिएटिविटी ये सब सुनने में बहुत अच्छा लगता है और uh, ऐसा बोलना भी बहुत अच्छा लगता है कि हाँ ठीक है वो तो क्या आजकल का क्या टर्मिनोलॉजी है छपरी बोलते हैं कुछ अलग बाल कलर अलग होता है उनके कपड़े अलग होते हैं पर एम में होते हैं फॉलोअर्स या व्यूज मिलियंस में तो ये मतलब इट्स दैट इज स्टिल अ लिटिल फार ऑफ फ्रॉम व्हाट वी टॉकिंग अबाउट तो रियल वर्ल्ड में तो यही है कि हमें ऐसा काम करना है जो ज्यादा पॉपुलर हो नाउ एज एज अ परफॉर्मर आई वुड चूज टू परफॉर्म फॉर द मासिस आई वर्क फॉर रेडियो तो रेडियो ऑलवेज वर्क फॉर द मासिस डजेंट वर्क फॉर अ नीश ग्रुप डू यू डू यू गो थ्रू दिस थॉट प्रोसेस वेन यू सिलेक्ट वॉट प्रोजेक्ट यू वॉन्ट टू डू नेक्स्ट डू यू थिंक यू वॉन्ट टू वर्क फॉर a larger audience or or a, a mass film see maine to apne aap ko separate nahi kiya separate to kisi aur ne kiya hai mujhe ya hum jaise logon ko ki hum niche hai hum uh, uh, contemporary nahi hai ya hum you know ye hai maine to kuch nahi kiya main to aapko bol rahi hu sri devi was my uh, okay. inspiration so th- there's no one else who's done mass films like her and made it really convincing nagin yeah. like i mean yeah. come on nagina and yeah. you f- you found it very convincing you know yeah. why 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 that worked to maine to nahi kiya ki mujhe aise hi kaam karna hai main ye bolti hu ki jo mujhe mile mujhe samajh mein aana chahiye एंड कि क्योंकि मेरी फोटे ये है कि मैं ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन काम अच्छा लगता है जहां पर मैं नहीं दिखू उसमें मुझे ज्यादा मजा है एंड आई फील दैट इज अ फोटे फॉर मी 
then you must give me what I am good at. Okay. Because then I will shine. Because end of the day, we all only want to shine. Whether you have written it in commercial film, mein, soccer or it will be made. But seriously, I just want to work. आज कल तो सौ करोड़ से ऊपर सात सौ करोड़ और आई थिंक पठान के तो लेटेस्ट फिगर्स आर सम थाउजेंड करोड़ आई डोंट नो इफ और पता भी नहीं है कि वो सही है कि नहीं बट फिगर्स तो हैं वहाँ पर यू नो ओ की हम अगर बात करें तो वो काफ़ी हावी हो रहा है इन आर लाइव दे आर सो मेनी डिफरेंट प्लेटफॉर्म आर कमिंग अप लॉर्ड ऑफ पीपल आर थिंकिंग लॉर्ड ऑफ एक्टर्स आर ऑल्सो रिक्वेस्टिंग के अरे भाई ओ टी पे नहीं थिएटर में जाके हमारी फिल्में देखो Do you see a change coming? I see a big change because पहले तो हम ऐसे actors से मिलते ही नहीं थे हम सब थे अपने अपने you know little groups में tribes बोल लो जो भी है और बम्बई में रहो तो वो tribes change होती रहती हैं you see that trend as well um, but uh, what happens happened with all these streamers and OTT is that you get to now open your own cage where it's like blending and you know that content is king where the writers are getting their dues because they are the backbone of it we are not magicians actors are not magicians we are vessels you know so we are as good as the material you give us it is it it's for everybody on the whole so now you know because of these streamers and everything of course there's a strategy there's a trajectory you want to follow and everything for your life it's like you know maine for example aapne pucha ki you know you want to do different things of course i want to do diff different things mujhe you know wo jo type casting mein hum lage rehte hain lage rehte hain now i don't have any bag of skills ki main अगर मुझे यही किरदार मिला है तो अभी नाउ चार फिल्म्स बिकॉज दैट्स वर्कड वही मिलेंगे तो वही मैं करती रहूँगी द थिंग इज आई वॉन्ट समथिंग एल्स सो दैट मेरा दिमाग जो है थोड़ा सा और खुले थोड़ा ओपन माइंडेड हो आई गेट टू इंटरेक्ट विद न्यू पीपल हु हैव से सपोज दैट कॉमिक टाइमिंग इज ब्रिलियंट एंड आई वॉन्ट टू लर्न समथिंग फ्रॉम इट क्योंकि हम एक्टिंग स्कूल तो गए नहीं वैसे भी कॉम्प्लेक्स थे तो तो हमें का क्या है आई जस्ट वॉन्ट टू बी ऑन सेट वेर आई एम ऑब्जर्विंग अदर एक्टर्स अदर पीपल बिहाइंड द कैमरा एक्चुअली मोस्टली बट देन यू गेट लाइक समथिंग फ्रॉम एवरी एक्टर इफ यू डोंट गेट मेंटली लेजी एंड दैट्स योर ओन प्रोसेस यू नो वी गेट मेंटली लेजी वी गेट फिजिकली लेजी वी टायर्ड वी बर्न आउट बिकॉज यू नो एंड मेनी थिंग्स बट यू लर्न दैट बैलेंस एज यू गो अलॉन्ग बट मेरी तो इच्छा रहेगी मेरी हर फिल्म डिफरेंट लगे क्योंकि मुझे मजा आ रहा है वो वो सीखने में ओके डज एनीवन वांट टू पुट अप अ क्वेश्चन वी आर ग्लैड टू टेक अ क्वेश्चंस इफ देयर देयर आर एनी एंड देन वी कैन मूव ऑन या देयर इज वन क्वेश्चन हियर गुड इवनिंग मैडम सो आई 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 हैव अ वेरी व्हाट आई मीन इज दैट मैडम what will you do if if different also becomes type cast ke aap different karte jao karte jao uska bhi ek type cast nikal ke aayega to aap different mein bhi type cast ho jaoge example ayushman khurana ka le sakte hum ke wo different karta karta wo different mein type cast ho gaya ab usko regular cinema cinema mein accept nahi kar pa rahe hai koshish kar rahe hai ha par wo successful nahi ho raha hai to wo ek ott wo bhi leke aa raha hai ke aap different to kar rahe ho पर वो भी एक टाइप कास्ट मोड में जा रहा है तब आप हाउ वुड यू कोप अप विद दैट इट्स अ वेरी गुड क्वेश्चन बिकॉज यूर राइट बिकॉज यू नो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल सी द ऑडियंस इज नॉट सेपरेट फ्रॉम आस ऑडियंस लाइक समथिंग देन यू कीप डूइंग दैट प्रोड्यूसर्स नो दैट इट्स वर्किंग सो द प्रोड्यूसर विल कम बैक टू दैट एक्टर ओनली दैट एक्ट्रेस ओनली सिंग दैट यार इसको तो ये दिस इज बेस्ट ऑन सो इट्स इट you know it's a it's a little of a spiral for all creative people and especially actors because we are in the limelight ki uh, you know we are bringing something new to the table every single time is not possible <laughs> and and that stagnancy like i said i started the talk with bitterness resentment yeah. stagnancy 
with that thing that you're in your comfort zone with that yeah. chal ghar to chal raha hai na yaar log pasand to kar rahe hai na 50 mm-hmm. log hain jisme se matlab you know um, i have never got any disrespect from any of my fans no matter what work i've done mm-hmm. you know whether it's this is uh, different from the other e- equally have been very you know deeply cherished so that is something i am also trying to um, you know uh, understand and you only understand once uh, your perspective changes you know and your perspective changes with experience g- getting more knowledge and uh, yeah learn something new i feel <coughs> okay uh, okay there are two more we'll take two more and then we can continue our talk hi so like you said that you wanted to do acting and you have done anything to achieve your dream so there must have been many hurdles and rejections that you have faced yeah. throughout your career so like how did you cope up with that and how did you deal with all the negative things tumko hamesha positive hi hona hai optimist mil hona hai wo bhi dhundla hai wo bhi matlab wo orbit ko aapko break karna hoga kaise bhi and uh, आई मीन ऑफकोर्स एडवर्सिटीज तो सबकी लाइफ में अप एंड डाउन हैं बट अभी नाउ इफ यू आस्क मी कि वॉट वुड यू वॉन्ट टू डू इन योर लाइफ आई वुड स्टिल से आई लव एक्टिंग सो मच आई लव द क्राफ्ट आई हैव रिस्पेक्ट फॉर पीपल हु बिकॉज लाइफ इज हैपनिंग वेदर योर फिल्म आर वर्किंग और नॉट यू नो एंड दैट लाइफ इज नॉट ऑलवेज पॉजिटिव वी ऑल नो दैट you know and your attitude and your work ethics and your intelligence is the only thing that will actually help you in your life and which means protecting yourself as a woman in the industry or any any industry is absolutely your thing to do you have yeah. to know how to protect yourself and that comes with learning integrity so and uh, for any artist i believe uh, rejection is a part of the process right i mean you create every day and it is not necessary that uh, all of what you create will be accepted yeah um, i think rejections ko accept kar sakta hai wahi artist hota hai otherwise then you become too um, focused on just one thing ki nahi nahi i have this film ye to hit honi hi chahiye aur aisa kabhi nahi hota expectations hoti hai aur aisa kabhi nahi hota aapne mehnat ki hai you know bura lagta hai na aapne mehnat ki hai sabne mehnat ki hai aur 4 saal se wo picture aayi nahi sabke sath hua hai irfan khan or whatever they put their own money for films and stuff like that you know so you have to take risks um and because again the stagnancy Uh, you know h- uh, helps you uh, you know really take risks because without that you're not moving forward yeah. you know without yeah. i said apne aap ko to reject mat karo na hum to fir bhi us uh, um, generation se hai ki instant gratification humko nahi mila hai yeah hum mehnat karenge to kuch milega hum fail का वो ही सोच uh, सोचना बंद कर दें कि ये दिस माय वर्थ सेल्फ वर्थ इज डिपेंडेंट ऑन हाउ मच यस हाउ मेनी लाइक्स आई गेट ऑन हमारा तो है ही नहीं yeah. तो वो 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 कनेक्शन तो बैठता ही नहीं है यू नो सो यू वर सेइंग के बॉम्बे में बैड हैबिट्स को भी लोग ज्यादा प्रोत्साहित करते हैं कुड यू इलेबोरेट ऑन दैट ये क्या है <laughs> देखो आर्टिस्ट हैं तो हमारी हैबिट्स भी बहुत अतरंगी होती हैं we are uh, very colorful people <laughs> you know should we so, get into the details you know, i mean <laughs> details we can go through many details there are many layers to it uh, so we have time is <laughs> <laughs> but meri sabse buri aadat hai ki main exercise nahi karna chahti hu but i know how dependent my mental health is on that okay one habit is uh, waking up in the morning and just doing your uh, riyaz jo bhi ho ye body riyaz ho mental riyaz ho fir uh, matlab uh, baaki sari uh, habits hain jo matlab main college students ko kya batau yaar aap hi bataoge mujhe aur kya hai <laughs> nahi i so atarangi habits ke bare mein to zyada charcha hum na hi kare to acha hai yes. then otherwise fir hum wahan baithenge aur ye log sab yahan baithenge ha exactly so i think you had a question right uh, can we have the mic please yeah 
Um, hi, my name is Tanishka and I had two questions. Uh, first of all, how important is it for someone to realize that they have this natural talent in a particular field? For example, acting. There are different types of actors who prefer different genres. So did you have a point of realization that I want to be this type of an actor? So I'll tell you something very important that I realize now. Somebody asked me, what's your genre? I'm just like, I have never been able to uh, have the agency before to actually typecast myself as a genre. I will say that I've said yes to work from different genres because I did not have the capability of sitting at home. Maybe only Leonardo DiCaprio can at, at, at his point of life, where he can sit at home and say that, I have to a film for four years. We have no idea, we have no idea, we have no idea. So, we have said yes to everything. We have not said yes to it when we this script is not going to work. Or, and I'm just like, listen, whatever it is, it's very subjective. You say bad, say good, say good, it's so subjective because yeah. at that time, it was the most important thing for me. कि मैं घर छोड़के अपने बच्चे को छोड़के मैं फिल्म के सेट में कुछ सीखने जा रही हूँ और कुछ यू नो करके आऊँगी. That was it. That's it. So I can't say I can't reject myself and betray myself saying that I'm only this genre of actor. No man. I want to be. I want to be cast. Okay. And uh, another well, question yeah, I had. Yeah. Uh, Nature versus nurture that happens in every field. So yes. yeah. like nurture that you said, Riyaz, you do every day in the morning yeah. or something. So how important is it to like nurture yourself in this field? It is the most important thing. Okay. And if we go into self-love, it's got the intricacies of uh, because we also come from a culture of seva you know where you know we do help each other we understand community service we understand so so much but i feel like you have to nurture yourself as a human being um uh, whether it's gaining knowledge whether you're just sitting because end of the day you're answerable only to yourself whether you're religiously um, agnostic or atheist or whatever, your conscious mind is the only thing you're sitting with yourself. Then who said what? Who said what? It's a skill. You know, you're not numb. You're a human being. You're not a machine. It does affect you, but reflection. I feel that, you know, nurture yourself with the food. Um, um, or, I mean, food for thought food for good company or the lack of it and everything is okay whatever whatever feels like you can nurture yourself and that is going i mean whatever you decide for yourself is the right one that's it aap kisi se bhi suggestion kar lo but there will be nothing more than your instincts and your impulse and your intuition there are the three most important things nurture that ye bahut osho type answer tha but I want a Priyanka Bose answer, which means, are actors born or are actors created? That also is, uh, uh, again. No, show sure. Priyanka Bose. No, I'll tell you. You know who I'm envious of most? Who? Are non-acting children actors, child actors. Uh, they have no affectation. They are not here to impress anybody. And there's only truth and that you cannot um, uh, copyright in any way. So, um, I mean, I can tell you many examples, but the most exam uh, you know, exemplary work is of the child actor in Lion, if you've seen yeah, it. Yeah. And you cannot take that away. He's never worked in his life. Yeah. And uh, you cannot take that away from a veteran who will say, Ki, yaar, ye kaise kiya, yaar? But you know what he remembers me from? From the Marathi film I did. Playing a mother. So he doesn't care about who Oscar gaya, ki yaha gaya, ki waha gaya. He cares about ki, you know, how he felt. So that again, actors are born or created. I don't know, yaar. Main kaafi longo ko dekhti hoon, to bachpan se acting kar rahe You know? Or phir bhi acting nahi sikhe. <laughs> you know, now I want to go to say acting school, say about three, four months and everything. Mm -hmm. I'm like, Kuch aur mujhe batao, 
यू नो अंडरस्टैंडिंग हो मेंटोर्स क्या होते हैं ये तो हम वहाँ से आए नहीं थे ना तो फॉर मी इट्स लाइक द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग आई टेक अवे इज लाइक डिट ही गो टू एनी एक्टिंग स्कूल एंड मोस्टली इट्स अ नो ही इज अ सेवन ईयर ओल्ड टेन ईयर ओल्ड बॉय और अ गर्ल एंड ही लीव्स यू विथ very very honest vulnerable feelings and that's it you're left and on this note i just would want to request everyone if you've not watched lion uh, you're missing out on a on a wonderful story it's a, a real life story and it's a beautiful beautiful film and honestly i've seen it more than five times and every uh-huh. time i've cried you know i mean the last scene where it even when they get departed and all so it's just a beautiful beautiful film सो ना कमिंग बैक टू द डिस्कशन आजकल ये बहुत डिबेट चल रहा है कि साउथ का सिनेमा अच्छा है या मेन स्ट्रीम सिनेमा अच्छा है या फिर रीजनल सो रीजनल सिनेमा स्पेशली इन गुजरात अभी धीरे कुछ पाँच दस सालों से थोड़ा सा यू नो वी ट्राइंग टू री इन्वेंट और वी ट्राइंग टू एक्सपेरिमेंट विद न्यू टॉपिक्स बट बिफोर वी गो टू गुजराती सिनेमा वट्स योर टेक ऑन द साउथ वर्सेज नॉन साउथ डिबेट देर इज नो डिबेट like okay. ajit said that uh, um, you know give importance to regional cinema now we have always existed yeah and uh, and there is no debate because a good story is a good story and is a good story and needs support and and producers need to see it because you can see that the south uh, is doing so well why because they have let that go about they just want to tell really good malayali cinema is doing exceptionally well our actors want to work and collaborate with them they are jealous that you know they are remaking some stuff and i'm exactly on the same boat because i just we are just hungry as people as artists we just want to tell true stories we want to reach out to the audience saying that please please come in please fill our seats or go like you know and regional cinema has always existed with that independently of everything else so there is no debate <laughs> so uh वैसे डिबेट तो है ही नहीं and what i also personally feel is a, a story is a story and a good story yeah. is a good story and as long as it reaches to uh, people and strikes a chord yeah. that's what that matters right yeah. and eventually if the numbers are also speaking for themselves then there is absolutely no debate but moving on um हम ये ओ के जब से जोन में आए हैं ना तब से एक चीज़ हुई है वो है टू मच ऑफ स्टोरीज ओके सो नाउ डू यू थिंक दैट रिगार्डलेस ऑफ इट बीइंग अ गुड स्टोरी और अ बैड स्टोरी व्हिच आई थिंक इज वेरी सब्जेक्टिव डू यू थिंक दैट द शेल्फ लाइफ ऑफ स्टोरीज हैव रिड्यूस्ड शेल्फ लाइफ ऑफ स्टोरीज में समझी नहीं मतलब हाँ थोड़ा सा ओवर स्टिमुलेशन हो जाता है इफ यू आर द ओनली काइंड ऑफ पर्सन दैट ओनली नेटफ्लिक्स एंड चिल्स यू आर एक्चुअली फॉर गेटिंग मैनी थिंग्स लाइक यू नो इफ आई दैट्स वाई आई डोंट गेट इन टू अ लॉट ऑफ सीरीज वॉचिंग बिकॉज वंस आई एम इन दैट जोन देन आई हैव टू फिनिश इट सो आई बिकॉज आई हैव कमिटमेंट टू शूज लाइक इन द सेंस एक बार कर दिया तो मतलब करना ही है पूरा ही है यू नो सो सो इट्स वेरी डिफिकल्ट बिकॉज देन आई एम लाइक एक नहीं 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 वायलेंस नहीं देखेंगे अभी अभी आई जस्ट वॉन्ट बी लूसड इन माई माइंड थोड़ा फ्री थिंकिंग तो ऐसा देखेंगे कि इट टच इज दिस फ्रीक्वेंसी एंड ऑल दैट सो आई फील लाइक एवरी वन हैज गॉट देर ओन फिल्टर विद द होल नेटफ्लिक्स एंड चिल थिंग राइट नाउ एंड 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 स्टोरीज वी ऑल नीड स्टोरीज या यू नो सम ऑफ इट इज एन एस्केप सम ऑफ इट इज क्राफ्ट स्किल टेक्निक वट एवर यू कॉल इट बट एज लॉन्ग एज इट इन इंट्रीक समथिंग आई फील लाइक देर इज अ स्टोरी फॉर वॉट Whatever genre you want to catch right now, it's quite interesting. It's a lot, but it's interesting. So I'll probably rephrase my question. So, uh, for example, um, any series that has come in, say, in 2022 or 23, uska recall ya fir uski story will not remain in my mind as long as a Friends episode has stayed. so friends yeah even tarak mehta ka ulta chashma for that matter the characters or the story you know it it stays for a longer time in our in our minds now what is happening is every friday there is new stuff coming out ya to netflix de dega ya to z5 de dega ya to hotstar de dega ya to prime de koi na koi to de hi dega aur koi nahi dega to theater to de hi dega right 
there's no recall value of there those, is no recall uh, that right. is what is happening with songs right a lot of people complain ke bhai pehle ke gaane antaksharya hum khelte hain to sabse pehle purane gaane kyon yaad aate hmm kyunki unki shelf life bahut lambi hai um do you think that's happening to stories i mean i mean there's a point to what you said you know um but at the same time if i had to really argue this um there's a popularist culture yeah. where friends yeah. why does it have a recall value as, uh, yeah. as opposed to not everything is that yeah. that's popular tarak uh, yeah. mehta yeah. kar yeah. Uh, ulta chashma but then there's also the other uh, you know films uh, that pavan ji was saying yeah. uh, about the uh, usual suspects yeah why it's not a popular film but why do you remember it because it's really well written mm. so now the thing is for an actor who's hungry like for example trial by fire if you've seen yeah it's a biopic it's about upahar cinema ka tragedy that you me even though i have been in delhi and two people i knew in uh, uh, my school died i will remember it you know why because the research was so bang on Mm. and because you uh, me as a person as a human or a you know sociology honors or whatever i gave a lot of emphasis on um, uh, research and uh, so that research is uh, great now it's not popular cinema mm. upahar tragedy matlab popular kaise ho gaya you know but you remember them why why because it it, it just works it's just written really well Okay uh I can now take questions uh, one or two from the audience if there are any we have last uh, couple of minutes yeah there's one uh can we send the mic there Yeah Hello ma'am Hello So um first of all great session uh, amazing to getting to know you um So you started with theater, and then you went, you you know, you went into movies, and now you're, you know, going to be introduced in OTT platform, as you said, right? So over the years, what even the discussion that you know is happening here is, the mediums have, you know, they keep changing the way you tell stories, the way you reach the audience. The mediums are always changing. Um, has there is does that cause any change in the method of acting? or the way you act the the way you uh, want to reach out to the audience because we know there's a very clear line between theater is separate cinema is separate cinema and ott might still you know there might be a vortex where they join hands together but theater and cinema are completely very very different with the way they are written the way they are directed production everything so what about acting so different people have different methods there are some cinematic genius that you can't take away for example irfan saab is was a genius when it came to his cinematic abilities of being completely um, emotionally sensitive in front of the camera right didn't know him as a person but i'm just like in awe of everything that he's done uh, again om puri saab now these people have done a theater but it's just a choice it's like what choice of medium that you choose i have done theater i love it uh but it wasn't my medium because i am now learning uh, cinema i have been inspired by cinema and instinctually i'm a method actress but is that practical in the context that ek hindi film mili mujhe abhi abhi hum 6 mahine se wohi kar rahe hain but 6 mahine mein us character mein nahi reh sakti na bhai 6 months ke baad unhone fir se mera date liya hai तो ये जो इंस्टिंक्चुअली मेरा जो मेथड एक्टिंग का वो है वो मुझे ही तोड़ना पड़ेगा दैट रिजिडिटी मुझे ही तोड़ना पड़ेगा एंड आई हैव टू सी दैट यू नो आई हैव टू बी स्मार्ट अबाउट इट बिकॉज आई आई कैन नॉट बी इन दैट सेम जोन बिकॉज द अदर जोन्स दैट आई हैव टू ऑल्सो कैश इन ऑन right so um, yes i've got a lot of training from theater and everything and it's uh, amazing but the kind of uh, um, you know aspiration i have uh, for in front of the camera where uh, i can completely forget everything and there's only oneness there's only one one then you know god it's like that 
you know you're aligned so that's the only language i want to know actually i mean i have great uh, appreciation for a lot of stage artists uh, the amazing um, um, actors i work with uh, who are great stage actors i'm just in awe of them because uh, those are the you know issues i have with my body or with my language and things like that so i'm just like i feel honored that i'm also sharing that space under the same umbrella saying that you know what it's school all over again you are different i'm different but we're going to mix it somewhere yeah yeah i'm also finding all right i have space for wow well, it become too loud no uh, i have space for one last question if anyone wants to ask nahi to main to puchunga hi okay so we can all right so we can have one question from uh, preeti or or your okay all right okay <laughs> Mom, as you talked about child actors, and you said that their work uh, is genuine and it reflects honesty, and that's because they do not think about many aspects. And do you think that it also molds their life in such a it molds their life in a completely different way at a very early age, and they're not even aware about it? So, do you think it affects their life because there are many byproducts that come with acting? It does. and that's a great question because when i used to be auditioning for a lot of ads and a lot of validation was given to this child actor who was also acting and everything to bhai sahab keh rahe hain ki nahi tumne ganda kiya tumko chocolate nahi milega to bahut dar humko to bahut chot pahunchti thi to i'm just like that's no life for any child ki uska unka ghar chal raha hai because of the child working वो तो हम तो समझते ही नहीं है हालांकि इफ माय डॉटर सेज कि टुमारो शी वांट्स टू आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू क्लिप हर विंग्स एंड से नो यू कांट बिकॉज आई एम जस्ट लाइक इफ यू वांट टू आई विल सपोर्ट यू टिल आई कैन एंड बट यू हैव टू मेक इट बट नो दैट देयर विल बी एडवर्सिटीज बट आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू से दैट दिस इज द ऑर्बिट यू विल हैव टू बिलोंग बिकॉज आई फील लाइक people who manage uh, young child artists who are brilliant from day one have to be really compassionate people and they have to be really really of course they're courageous but they have to be really compassionate people and that i feel sometimes is a lost thread and um and and it hurts me as a person very much because i know what's happening like it's in the art circle a lot uh, you know and it's not only here it's abroad as well kyunki humne wahan par bhi audition diya hai jahan par ladki bol rahi hai no 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 my dear if you wear the uh, you know your legs are too short uh, you should wear like um, uh, and she is a 12 year old yeah. to tell her that her legs are too short and she should be wearing boots just to make her and shorter skirt to make her leg. i mean you're over sexualizing her and entire natural process yeah. that in itself is wrong and yeah. i'm like to be constantly self aware that galti se bhi yeah. mujhse na ho jaye i'm i'm leading by example ki galti se bhi mujhse na ho jaye meri beti ke liye hmm. but i think that's the price that people pay right and for any uh, industry profession when at whatever age you enter there is always a price that will pay I mean, at any age that you learn. Preeti, one last question we can have. No, um, it was just because you're talking about your daughter and uh, Priyanka. If you think this is not the right forum, I'm a mother as well of a young child. Have you ever dealt with what is the society given guilt? You know, cake ma ho, you're leaving your child going for shoot. And if you have, have you how have you dealt with it? I know, I know this may not I have therapist. resonate with the audience, yeah. but I just want to know how did you do that then? I mean, I have a therapist. I will oh. uh, openly tell you that I have no shame about uh, reflecting on the fact that there's a seed of guilt given to women. Yes. Men have different things to deal with, but women have a seed of guilt about the construct of what kind of mother you are. Thank Or you. the duty, the sense of duty you will have to have for your husband. I'm telling you right now, we've come of age and experience and uh, reverence for each other, my partner and I. Where it's like I will not stop you how you want to express yourself, and that in itself doesn't liberate me, my dear. It actually makes me 
go inside of a shell saying that log kya kahenge wo conditioning hai yeah. and Jee. wo conditioning kahan se aayi hai mujhe pata nahi if you see all my choices it's always been very bold yeah. and i wouldn't have been able to do it if i didn't have support but nobody told me that once i have a child they will always note your absence not the child itself but everyone else around exactly, you exactly priyanka yeah yeah will let you yeah. know what your place is and the thing is that's why i i i tell because i it's a narrative in myself the spiral of shame and guilt that we have that's the biggest spiral it's like all my choices now will have to pehle to main main bahut aise aise karti thi hamesha is like tum mat bhulo tumhari beti teenager hai abhi good thought process yes mm. now my choices will also be different i'm just like okay if not for me i'm leaving something behind for her forget mm. legacy yeah but wo wo jo wo jo guilt and shame ka jo dance hai wo to hum khel hi rahe hain abhi now it's like okay how can i break away from it because whatever you choose again it's a liberation you know what i'm saying so so this is actually a very long uh, discussion that long, we could very have very personal discussion later in the have. evening maybe but yeah. Uh, for now, but, I think we'll have to. Thank you, thank you for that. Yeah. It, it takes guts to admit also something like of this. Of course, thank it you. does, and uh, life drastically changes. <laughs> Absolutely. So life changes with every um, landmark in or every decision that you take. So ये होता ही है. That is life, and to balance the what I think is it's a very difficult uh, task to be an artist. क्योंकि अगर आप एक normal um, If you're in a normal job, तो choices थोड़े से normalish होते हैं पर इसमें every step you take, you're looked at by so many people, you're you're being judged by so many people. तो ये होता है probably that's the process or that's a part of being an artist. That's the price probably that we pay. So thank you, uh, Priyanka. It was really a very nice, um, very entertaining, and um, I really enjoyed myself, and I hope all of you did too. so let's once again give her very round applause for priyanka bose for being here